On the road again, the forecast is looking good this Memorial Day weekend as thousands of Marylanders are expected to travel in record numbers. WJZ is live from the Fort McHenry Tunnel where traffic can really back up as we know. George Solis with what you need to know before you pack up and make plans. Hi, George. Hi, well, cheaper gas and more money in people's pockets. Triple A saying all of it amounting to more travel this busy holiday weekend, no matter how you choose to get there. Call it the unofficial kickoff to summer. This Memorial Day weekend, a record number of Americans are ready to celebrate. AAA estimating nearly 38 million Americans are ready to get away. This is the highest Memorial Day travel volume we've seen since 2005. Marylanders also getting in on the trend, especially after a very miserable spring. The sun came out just in time, and it's, it's great to hear that the numbers are up from AAA. For the second year in a row, more than 800,000 Marylanders will travel. The highest since the 2005 peak, a big part of it, cheaper gas. By the numbers, most will be traveling by cars, followed by planes, and lastly, bus or train, which saw a decline from last year. Just this Memorial Day weekend alone, more than 300,000 drivers are expected to cross over the Bay Bridge. Police say an ever constant reminder just how outnumbered they are during the holiday. Be aware. Be aware. You have to be aware of your surroundings, and we need the public. To participate in the safety. That means no texting and driving, wearing seatbelts, and when you can, using public transportation. And of course, no drinking and driving, which safe driving advocates say year after year play a role in road deaths. 30% of all traffic deaths on Maryland roadways are still caused by drunk drivers, the same, same percentage 10 years ago. So we're making progress, but nobody's waving a victory flag yet. So all that means police will be out in full force this holiday weekend. Reporting live, I'm George Solis. Now back to you on TV Hill. All right, George, thank you. More cars can mean more car trouble, so make sure that they are tuned up before any long road trips.